welcome back in this lecture we are straight going to create the registration form for the customers if someone clicks this so they can create an account and we will also register a user uh, so we th then can easily uh, log in uh, to this so we'll basically uh, create a duplicate page of this checkout page so simply we will go to file menu and we'll click save is so we can create a duplicate that will be something like uh, I mean uh, customer underscore register dot php this is a page save and now customer underscore register this page has become customer underscore register dot php so we will just uh, remove these all things including the products box and this all so in here we will just simply create a form and uh, action will be is equal to the same page customer underscore register dot php and uh, method will be post these are common parameters for a form action is very important to which page the person should go after clicking the submit button and method to which uh, method we are receiving the data to get or post post is a method which we always use when we don't want to show the the information the data say, uh, sent by the user we don't want to show that data in the address bar and get method is, uh, uh, get method is used to show the data in the browser so after that ink type ink type uh, will be multi part form data because we are also getting an image from the user and we'll just simply close this form tag inside the form tag we will create a table with the I mean with a line center and width will be almost 750 pixel that's it we'll close this table too and you are now familiar with the tables inside the table we need to create some uh, TRs and the first TR will be for uh, you know for uh, displaying a text like uh, create an account and we used h2 take to make it bigger td close that's it for the first tr and after the first tr we'll simply say create another tr inside which we will add two tds and we'll just copy this whole thing we'll paste again and again this tr because we need it more than five times so that's done now the first thing is this one basically uh, we need to undo this whole things and all of the things we should do at once for example we will need uh, this first one aligned right so it can look better the first td which where we will simply insert a text and uh, that's it okay now we can again copy this whole using control c you can paste again and again that's it now it's fine one thing we have just forgot but leave that in the first we will say uh, customer name that's it inside the second td we'll insert a, an input tag which type will be text and name will be is equal to c underscore name this is very important because we will get the input uh, data later on in php second one we'll say user customer email 
and inside this we will just simply copy this input we'll paste it here we'll just say C email and the third one simply say customer password and here inside the second tier TD we'll paste that input we'll see it's a customer pass and the type will also be password and then after that need to go and check out what we have next so we have next country so in here we need to say customer country and in the second TD we'll insert a select we insert a select tag and its name will be C underscore country and inside the select box sorry the select tag which actually may uh, actually creates a list for people to select from so in here we will uh, insert option takes and inside the first one we will write uh, select a country and after that simply option Afghanistan and Afghanistan India Japan need to copy and paste them all of the three I will copy using control C I paste it two times can change this all Pakistan and Israel and you can say something like uh, Nepal United Arab Emirates and United States and United Kingdom anyways it is a list basically so we have created this list and uh, after that uh, we can say uh, select a city we will write customer city and we will do it like here for example search and input type is equal to text and here they will write their city themselves C city is the name of this input after that we have contact number uh, customer contact and in here we will just copy this input using control C and we'll paste it here Let's change the name to customer contact and uh, one thing we have just forgot here which is the customer address basically so we can uh, simply add one more uh, row after the contact one more column basically sorry after this so click we'll say customer underscore address this will be text and 300 characters save so you can see the structure or here customer address so we need to put customer address here customer address and in here we will use something like uh, text area calls will be 20 and rows will be 10 
and we will also close text area so this is something or oh, its name will be is equal to c underscore address and after that last or not last uh, simply here after the password we'll simply copy this tr and we'll paste it here and change this to customer image <coughs> and we'll just we'll change the type as well to file and this to c underscore image so customer can upload their image as well and in the last we will just add one more tr and uh, inside that a td which will have an input type is equal to submit name of this will be register and value will be is equal to create account that's it td close control s to save <coughs> we have simply done this html work uh, for this form now you can check it out coming here refreshing this page and we'll just simply click this uh, customer underscore register or php page should come here just click it and you can see it is saying uh, create an account but one tr has problem and some just check it what is th uh, okay there is a tr which is actually broken so we can create it again and one thing more we need to just simply say to this first tr a line will be centered and we will add some kind of call span to this like 8 or uh, 6 6 call span to the first one and also to the last button here tr will be aligned centered and uh, input td will have some call span is equal to 6 that's it control s to save now come here refresh so you can see create an account and after the person adds their information so it can be customer address we can make it a little bit small uh, to 10 calls and uh, 5 rows control is to save again and come over here refresh the page and we simply can add some kind of any you know an input tag is enough for address input type is equal to text name is equal to c underscore address and that's it control is to save come here refresh the page and you will see this thing very simple very small uh, small and simple so after the person insert their details so they can click create account and account will be created but we have to do our uh, you can see that select a country you can see all the countries list you can add more but I have added this just for example and the password will be like this and they can also choose a picture from their computer so that's very simple uh, straight we will come uh, in next lecture will come and will start work from here I mean the PHP script for this uh, whole form to insert the data into our table called customers so stay tuned <coughs>